Hey guys, it's Matt. Welcome to Speed Tutor, and today we're going to be looking at the sprite editor and how to use it. I wanted to use this to create a particle effect which used three different sprites instead of one because if you would normally add a material to a particle system, it would just be one sprite that would be repeated. But I wanted to be able to use multiple, so we'll go into using the sprite editor. So be sure to throw a like on this video if it helps you out and give me any tips and tricks that could help anybody else out too. So if you bring any sprite, whether that's an atlas sprite which is multiple sprites on one sheet or a texture sheet in itself, you can click on it and you get a something in the inspector. You need to set your texture to sprite 2D and UI. You need to make sure the sprite mode is on multiple or you won't be able to use the sprite editor to do that. You can set the filter mode to point which has no filter if your pixel art or something else that you bring in from your sprite or atlas sheet is a bit pixelated. Now, sprite editor may well be grayed out in your version and I'm using Unity 2020 and it would be grayed out by default. So to make this applicable, you need to go to Window, Package Manager, Filter by Unity Registry and just type in Sprite and you will get 2D Sprite and 2D Sprite is what you want to install to get the Sprite Editor. I will just quickly briefly show you that I've got a bunch of notes here that I want to use to be able to cut out and use in the Sprite Editor. These were all single images. I've just put them onto one long canvas and made sure that I've left space in between them so I can cut these out really nicely with a sort of rectangular cutout because that's what the Sprite Editor uses by default. So it's just a one long canvas. I'll say that unless you're specifying a specific color for them by default, have them as white so then you can adjust the color in Unity. So when you right click and import a new asset, I brought in the Atlas sheet that I want and I will click the drop down for the texture type and do Sprite 2D UI. Set the sprite mode to multiple and I will just hit apply. Now I can click on to open the sprite editor. And so what I can do is I can just left click and drag a slice around my note that I want. And we can actually select the edges and move these in and out. Just if we want to get closer to our object, we can rename at the bottom right. So I could call this note underscore one. We can set the size, the anchor point, and the dimensions of it. We can just hit apply and then we've created a slice for that sprite. We can do the same with our other. We can just select around it roughly because I don't need to be particularly accurate with this version. And we can do the same by making sure that I rename it and hit apply for that. And if you ever need to select on any of the other sprites that you've already done, you can click on them and then re-edit any of the names, sizes, or whatever you need. Always remember to hit apply each time. Then when we close that up, you can see that there'll be the cutout sprites as children of the main parent, and we can use these within the object. So this is how I worked out that for this case with my particle system, I've got a default material on this, which is just literally a faded white, which is the standard particles unlit shader. And I want to use a texture sheet animation for my particle effect. I can set the mode to sprites, and then I can use the notes from my previously taken atlas that I've just created and they need to share the same texture atlas and then I will get the differentiation of the different notes that I want to have within my particle. And this is exactly the outcome that I wanted using the sprite editor to cut out my own sprites. And of course you can cut out animated sprite sheets and you can be more precise with how you want to cut these out by putting equal spacing on each. But this was just a simple way to use a sprite editor to cut out some sprites. So I hope this helped you out. Come and support me on Patreon to get access to over 115 different projects, scripts, and so much more. Come and chat to me on Discord. Check out my great assets on the Unity Store. And thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Cheers.